I am Short Sleeve Samson. I got started back in the business 12 years ago. There was a midget wrestler back in my hometown of Rhode Island known as Tiny the Terrible. And uh, he got my contact info through a mutual friend, called me up and asked me if I wanted to try wrestling. I was a big fan of it. And uh, so being willing to give anything a shot at least once to at least say you'd be able to do it. Um, I did it. I did it on an independent level. And about a month or so went by. Got called back for a second show. And um, then the following evening, about 10.30 at night, this was on a Sunday, I got a call from WWE. And they asked me if I was interested in doing a spot the following night on Monday Night Raw. No prior training. I'm green. I'm new. So, went down to the Continental Airlines Arena down in New Jersey, and uh, all I was told was to make sure I had a suit. I arrived and sat for hours, not knowing what I was doing or even why I was there. And probably about a half hour before TV started, some of the agents came up to me and filled me in and at the start of Monday Night Raw, I was working a segment with Triple H, The Big Show, Stephanie and Shane McMahon and The Rock. And we were making a mockery on The Rock, setting up for WrestleMania. Well, long story short, thanked everybody when the show was done. Everybody said they were happy with my performance. And on my way home, I said, if I'm going to do this business, I think I'd better go get trained. That's how I got into this. I have known Marvin Ward on a personal level for over five years now. I had the opportunity to work with him when he was running Ward Family Promotions and TNT Wrestling. And it became more of a worker relationship and as we worked together more, we started becoming friends. Well. We were doing a double shot out in Georgia, and we had an afternoon show and an evening show. Well, in the afternoon show, I um, had a, a spot go bad where I was doing a suicide dive out into the, you know, out into my opponents. Well, they weren't there, and I went face first into the railings. Finished the match, even though they were willing to stop it and wrestled that evening as well. With my face out to here, I ended up breaking my nose, I needed stitches above my eye, I cracked my orbital bone, um, and I looked like the elephant man. But I still did it, because the fact that I am willing and determined to be committed to what I say I was gonna do. Well, that night, after the second show was over, Marvin and I were talking, and I told him that as long as he never gave up on wrestling, I would never give up on him. And I am here because the fact that I believe in Marvin, I believe in what this promotion, AWE, is going to do, and I'm just excited that I can be a part of this, one element, but yet a team to make AWE awesome. Personal goals for AWE, is to hopefully bring my character, Short Sleeve Samson, a midget wrestler. I'm hoping that I can take the parameters of midget wrestling and be able to expand them. Where I don't not necessarily want Short Sleeve Samson to be known as a midget wrestler, but Short Sleeve Samson to be known as a midget, uh, I'm sorry, a wrestler who is a midget. That's one of my goals. Because the fact that I did take the time to get trained. I, I'm a student of this craft. I'm constantly studying this business. And unlike, unfortunately, so many other guys that I don't think that they take it as seriously. Um, they get by on the fact that they may just be a gimmick. Well, that's not what I'm about. I'm a professional. So my thing is to bring my character and a wrestler who happens to be a midget into um, into a different light, into a fan's perspective. And then as well as to be a part of a team to take AWE and to put it as 
far mainstream as we possibly can with unlimited horizons and to see this thing from start to continuance. I think AWE, the, 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 it, it's, it's endless. I mean, seriously, here we have, in all honesty, a group of guys that have come together that from different walks in this business, from different personal experiences, all who have a, had a taste of big companies and of a lot of exposure and training, and now what we're doing is we're coming together with the same beliefs, the same visions, the same goals to take wrestling and to give the fans what they've been asking for, what they've been craving and starving for for years. They want to see wrestling. They don't want to see somebody talking on, on, on a mic, you know, in the middle of the ring for 20 minutes. They'd much rather see two guys beating the crap out of each other for 20 minutes. To see strong characters and to give the people by the end of the show that they paid their hard-earned money the show of their lives. This is awesome wrestler entertainment. Shorty Samson. This is 